There comes a time in every deck brewer's darkest days when his brain becomes a rainbow cacophony of deepest explosions. When color ceases to matter and all matter transfuses down into a swirling, swirling, never ending stream of chromatic, cornucopiatic insanity. When times become hard, life drains down, and you no longer make decks, but disasters. What I'm trying to say is, sometimes you gotta get weird with it. Do you wanna get weird with it? Let's get weird with it. I present to you a completely unnecessary journey into the bowels of deck building nonsense. I give you Clash of the Titans, five color Titan do nothing. That's right, this deck has power ultimate power, but it swirls and spins in the toilet bowl of purposelessness. Look, we begin with Kiora, Behemoth Beckoner, beckon she does, the Behemoths. Hello, Behemoths, come on in, the water's fine. With Kiora on the battlefield, Kruxa, Titan of Death's Hunger, and Yuru, Titan of Nature's Wrath draw cards. But wait! These titans won't be saddied by simply being cast from the hand, no! They must come from the graveyard! Thus Tamio, friend of titans, puts them in their place and gathers the resources needed to cast them from the deep. But lo! How will we gain the mana for this ridiculousness? Gilded Goose, Dryad of the Elysian Grove. And what else? I don't know, Banishing Light so we don't die instantly. Uh, Hydroid Crasis, draw more cards. Clear the Mind if we run out of cards. Thassa's Oracle if we run out of cards and want to win. And cure our best to see God because sometimes you just need some damage. Oh, and all the dual lands. Well, not all, but most of the dual lands. A good idea? No. A bizarre idea? Yes. Can it win games? Let's find out. Here we are, standard ranked. Bottom diamond. Story of our lives. Bottom diamond. The diamond that shines less bright than all other diamonds. All right, versus st you didn't strife, strifey, strifey. Ooh, we will keep this hand. Temple's nice here. Temple into something good. Hmm. Temple to temple. Yeah, we'll take that because. Kiora Croxa is good game. Clear the mind. Not great here. Right, so Croxa. Or no, Temple. Then Croxa. Well, Temple. Then Kiora. Then Croxa. That's you. Know, thinking ahead. Thinking ahead. That many turns. That's another Temple. No, that's too many. Temple to Temple. Temple to Temple sounds like a Greek sitcom. Temple to Temple. God to God. We're living life. Under the Pantheon. Temple to Temple. God to God. Just living life under the Pantheon. Da -dun 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 -dun. And yeah, you know, here. Oh, who's there? It's Zeus. Oh no, Zeus is here. Did you know Zeus was coming over for dinner? I forgot. Oh no. But da 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 temple to temple pantheon. No, temple to temple da da da. We're just living in the pantheon. You never know who's going to come by for dinner. Temple to temple da 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 da. 
All right. Ooh, I could just... Mm, well, I kind of just die if I do that. So... I Croxa! Draw one card. All right, let's Croxa. We still end up with three mana from this. Draw something good. Yeah, they lose a card. That's nice. Yeah, bye-bye, Banishing Light. All right, that didn't do much. So we will... I could Hydroid for one. Two, four, five. Nah, I don't care about that. Let's just do... Oh, you. Enter's tapped. And that's it. That's all. This is like the goofy neighbor on Temple to Temple. Temple to Temple is filled in an outdoor stadium. Well, that's a problem. That's a big issue for us. All right, we're at 11 life. Our entire deck does nothing, and we are dying slowly. Okay, well... Literally nothing I can do here. I can do this. Pay to life. There you go. Untap that. Play this for four. One, two, three, four. Okay. down. Get a card from Kiora. Does the Fabled Passage thing? Sure. Okay. We're all delighted. Alright. Gained some amount of life there. Two life. Drew lots of cards. Not sure those cards did much for me, but here we are. Block this. Get blown out. Okay, not as much as you'd think. Well, alright. That's not so bad. So, we can do it again. Let's... Enters tapped. Untaps it. Alright. And we'll do this for... Four again. Right. One, two, one, two, four. Okay. One, two, three, four. Pay four. Auto pay. Back to eight life. The old triple hydroid crisis plan. Turns out it's still good. Hydroid crisis, still good. Okay. No attacks. Discard Tamio and one more. Oh, I don't know. How about... Um... Probably you. Okay, well, I clicked it, so there it is. Bye, Goose. Right, got that. Draws a land. What's this? Okay, Nessie and Wanderer. Oh, no attacks! All right, well. Let's get... Strange then. By playing. Play two of these and say go, right? One, two, three, four, four, five, six. Or play another Hydroid Crisis for five. Hmm. It's a good question as to which I prefer. Um, uh, yes. Hydroid for five is the right choice. So, untap that. Untap it. Untap it. Radio. Hydroid Crisis for five. Finally, we're in that luxury spot where we no longer have to tap, you know, all the mana. Just the couple there. Just the one button. The one button, that's right. You, you, you rise up high in the socio mananomic platform and suddenly you're clicking one button all the plebeians down below 
All the four mana hydroid crazes plebeians. They're clicking. One, two, click, click, click. Ah, ah, my hand. Oh, my hand. It hurts from the clicking. It hurts from the clicking. And meanwhile, up here in the lofty echelon, we're just like, click, crasis. Click, crasis. Click, crasis. Click, crasis. Ah, what a leisurely life I live, says the one click crasis caster. That's what they say. What a leisurely life. They live. Meanwhile, Strife is feeling unhappy about the state of Hydroid Crisis times three. As I climb out the bottom of this game, I was sure to not win. But that's what happens when you're living temple to temple, pantheon. You don't know who's gonna come around. Well, you kind of do because your doors are pillars. You can pretty much see outside everywhere. Oh, who's that? Hades. Oh, no, it's Hades. Did you cook dinner? Oh, my wife is dead. Oh, my dog is dead. Oh, Hades is here. Ah, I'm dead. I'm dead. Then the spinoff comes up. Temple to temple, Pantheon. I am Hades, and now it's my show. Oh no, it's Hades. Now it's his show. Um, here we will get rid of. Oh, you. I don't think we're gonna play you, Temple of Mystery. All right, ten life. They have one card. We have lots of things. We will start to play them. We still cannot Croxa. We can Tamio, not quite well. Hold on. We can, no, no we can't. We can almost Tamio Croxa. We can four, five, six, seven, we can Kiora. Or whatever, actually Kiora is not terrible. Just Kiora. 8, 16, 21, kill them? No, 23, well, close. Oh, Croxa? Yeah, all right. We'll just big mana Kiora them. Why not? Making big jellyfish Hydra Beasts. Oh, the Conceit, look at that. Look at that. Is it the most exciting finish? No, but it's a finish. It's a win. Put it in the win bank. Ka-ching. All right, claim prize. And we play a game. That felt pretty good. We really climbed ourselves out of that hole. Digging deep, rising high. Up to the Pantheon sky. Oh, look at this. Wait till you see this person's name. I'm hiding it, but... Anatos. Anatos. This... Hand is a mess. Let's do it. Look at this. Look at this hand. Triple Goose Jellyfish Hydra. Triple Go. Look at that. Turn one. The turn one Witch's Oven. I wish one of these was green. Drawing an untappable green source is basically our best draw here. Do double goose into a, oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. We can, we can, that'll play. We can do this. Auto pay. Draw a green source. Huh? Draw a green source. Huh? Oh no, all right, well, we'll scry. We'll take the scry. Ooh, we won't take that scry though. That's one scry to Menai. One scry to Menai. All right, we've got an Uro. Next turn we can. Hydroid for two. That's not great. We can. Hmm, goose do nothing? That's additionally not great. Would like to draw a Kiora here. Eh, Tamio, really. 
Tamio, yeah, Tamio is best draw. All right, come on, Tamio. Okay, gonna live with a. Uh oh, well, that's a problem. That's a big. Oh, we got the Tamio. Okay, so we pay to life. We Tamio. Tammy Yoga. Tamio gets red because who's playing this card? We are. Get back our Euro to prevent that from happening. And that's not a terrible the turn. Holds our future. Is it? Is that a terrible turn? No. No, it's not. Although I guess Timorette just swings in for Tamio. Maybe. Okay. Cat comes back. Thought he was a goner, but the cat came back. Well, Mr. Timorette Demon had troubles of his own. Catty kitty cat. And he wouldn't leave alone. He put the cat in an oven and set him far away. He thought he'd bake the cat into a tasty pie that day. But the cat came back. Thought he was a goner, but the cat came back the very next day. Ooh, here. I think I might just want a Hydroid Crasis for three. Plus one Tamio. Yeah, let's do it. Hydroid for three. One, two, three. Pay that. Auto pay. Comes down, draws a little, and so on and so forth. For Temple, that's not doing me much. Turns out any pile of jank can work if you just keep playing Hydroid Crassuses. Crassi? Crassuses? Proceeds. Um, we would like to have a. I think, uh. Ooh, I think we want a. What do we want here? I think a banishing light, actually. Truth be told. Okay, Croxa. That's gonna get bye bye. Well, not really. I only have two mana. I only bye bye so many things. No land. Which I'm deeply enamored of. Spend their two mana to say bye bye, Croxa. Sure. That's a way to spend a turn. Then they're gonna swing in at Tamio. Oh, no swinging in at all. Well, okay, so. Interesting. Let us... What do we want here? Kiora. It's plus one for Kiora. Let me aid Behemoth Beckoner. Stone nothing. All right. Well, that's fine because we can... Euro. We're going to Euro Goose here. Yeah, Euro into Goose. Double land drop, pretty nice. Okay, mystery comes down. What do we have? What do we have? Ooh, Croxa. Um, no, that's not really necessary. Not the Kiora, really. Temple. Hey, that's not. Also, well, that's... I don't hate that. I don't hate that. Goose comes down. All right, well, next turn, no attacks. They can spend their mana to send away Euro. But we can try to get a Kiora... Right, cat comes back, kills us for one. They don't attack. 
which is fine. But they do attack. Still no mana. Winning this game because they have no mana. Field two land, mono black keep. Right. Draw is unsurprising. I think we want a... Ooh, what do we want here? We want to get a Euro in our yard. So, Kiora Behemoth Beckoner. Nope. All right. Stone. Nothing on that. Let's do Dryad. Plenty of cards there. Goose. All right. Get a food. Temple? What's temple look like? No, thank you. All right. No attacks here. Could attack for this. Why not? Because that, that gets a third mana. Well, if they want to do that, that's fine. That's fine. Damage here. Three damage. We have here. What can we leverage from our yard? Banishing light? That's not terrible. Banishing light witch's oven? We can do that. What do they have? What are they gonna play? A land? I hope no. I hope they don't play a land. I hope they just kind of fold. Like a house of cards. A house of magic cards. That could be a fun new format. Card EH. Card Mander. You have to continue to build your board as a house. And if it falls down, everything is destroyed. Is that a... Oops, a real oops or a fake oops? Is it an oops scoops? Could be. Well, let's see, wait. I think they're gonna attack. Do they attack? No, they don't. Notice again, this deck does well when the opponent does nothing. Okay, we still want Kiora. All right, Kiora, we're looking for you. There we are. Oh, look at that double Kiora. The dirtiest play possible. So let's do this. I think we can double Kiora. Double Croxa. Oh, this turn. This turn. All right, this is what this deck was meant to do. Watch this. Croxa comes down. Look at this. Discard, damage, draw a card. All right. Draw that tomb. Sure. Then we can untap. Kruxa. Um, let's see. One, two, get rid of the lands. Three, four, five. Five lands. So long, five lands. Proxa comes down again. Again, they discard. Take some damage. We... Ooh, look at that deck. Mono black, yuck. All right, play this. Oh, there's the... All right. Okay, you had two lands. So, you know, okay, well, look. Those games were fine. But we really, we want a barn burner. We want to, uh, we want to fight for our lives. We want a hard, scrabbling, clawing, gnashing, bruise battle. The fifth elephant. Cool name. All right, this hand. This hand we keep because we can maybe make it work. All right, black red temple. Don't care for that. 
I like, I don't care for that. Okay, so that gets there. Ooh, not a time for you, Kroxa. We're more of a blue-green deck at the moment. Okay, double temple. I like that. Okay, let's do pay two. Vasa. Vasa Oracle. Ooh, Goose. Okay. We can Kiora into Goose next turn. That's pretty good. That feels like something actually is happening. Oh, Risen Reef. Okay, well, we may be finding ourselves in a good old fashioned ramp off. Okay. Who can ramp over who or who? Untap this. Goose goes up. And let's attack. And we'll block. They wouldn't dare to block. Yeah, I didn't think so. Take that, the fifth elephant. Okay, next turn. Next turn, we will draw, let's say we draw a land. We play that land, that's four mana, five mana. We Euro, get another land. We could double Euro. Nine life, four cards, possible two lands. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's the play, that's the play. Assuming Cure lives here, four mana, it could do something. Four mana, all colors, but, okay. Cloud can seer. I like that play. They draw a card. They do double draw. All right, we're both on the draw and drill for days. All right, we're both on the drawing and gaining life. However, okay. Let's see if we can out ramp them. Yes, look at that. So, Euro comes down. Draws many cards. Fraxo. Faso, let's get that down there. Okay, scry one. Ooh, that would be good. But then, that means we don't have enough mana. Uh-oh. Okay, well. Because uh, now we cannot double. Fraxo, can we? Okay, so let's. Um, well, no, no point there because we, because we cannot do anything else. All right, well, that was a bit of a disappointment. Only got two cards. Only have four lands. I mean, five with Goose, kind of. They're at five. This comes into play tapped. Uh, all right, it's a. I feel an Omnath coming my way. A nasty, nasty Omnath. A nasty, nasty Omnath. Omnath? Oh, Risen Reef. Oh, the double reef. Okay. The art on this card is so good. It's so good. The next turn we have Dryad. Dryad comes down. We can untap Euro. Okay, Euro Dryad isn't that bad. Draw a land at some point and we get into Croxa territory. Oh, okay. Sure. Sure. All right. How's this gonna... Okay. Wow. All right. They have a... Heal... Something? Oh, okay. I don't fully understand that play, but... 
Here we are. So Euro comes down. We untap that. Maybe we draw two lands here. That would be good. Double land would be pretty good. That's a Tamiyo. That's a Temple of Malice, sure. Nope, don't need that. That goes away. All right, well, no attacks. I see, so next turn, they're gonna crack open my Kiora. To, yep, but that's okay, cause, they, well, hold on. No, they can't. They can't kill Kiora unless they throw away. Oh, okay, well, they can kill Kiora by throwing this. Okay. That is not great. They're, uh, ah, I see. Oh, they baited me on that. Look at that hard level bait. Also, these elemental decks are very cool. Right, well, I guess we're blocking. Yeah, we're blocking something. In comes a Risen Reef. They've now way outstripped us in mana. That's disappointing. We have really not drawn lands like we would hope so. Right, they are drawing lands forever. We are drawing no lands. Sure, block that. Dies anyway. Kiora goes down. They have a card. Ooh, I would hate that. I would hate if they played something here. Yep, I hate it. All right, well. What's our plan next turn? Kind of in a bad spot. In a very bad spot. A really, really bad spot. The worst spot? No. The mediocre spot? Yes. All right, Thunderkin Temple. Worst draw ever, I think. Okay, so we will Tamio. What's Tamio do? It's his backup. Kiora. Take some damage for us, I think. All right, let's do this. Let's do this into. Um, what if we? Ugh, ah, we need a red source. What if we searched for? Oh, let's see. Steam. Vents. Can we do that? No. All right. Well. Non oh, non-land. Oh, okay, that's why. Well, uh, then let us just look for, I don't know, Euro. Another Euro. Sure, nothing. Fine. Temple comes down. Hydroids, not four hydroid. Yeah, we'd four hydroid. Although we'd rather just Euro. I suppose. I mean, we, we're gonna look at this game. This isn't gonna end well. Our do nothing deck is being outstripped by their do nothing deck. It's turn 25 and we're just, all right, there we go. There we go. Now we're starting to get somewhere. No, not gonna, no, huh? That's a no on the, uh, okay, all right. Sure. All right, so three, four, five, six, so we can block one. Block two, really. Okay, block you, block you. Here we go, Tamio lives. 
Do not harm her scrolls. I... Can you harm a scroll? I mean, do not break my scrolls. Do not smash my scrolls. I don't know about harming a scroll, but... You know, here we are. Hey, speaking of fun facts... This deck used to run... Clarion. Blasting Clarion, or whatever it's called. So... Sure wish I had one of those right about now. But I don't. Just got all this. Traded them out for Banishing Light because I was tired of Torbron, the big dwarf, blowing me up. In retrospect, I would love, love a Clarion Bugle or whatever it is. The Clarion, you know... The deal three damage one. Blasting Bugle. Haunting Horn. Furnace of French Horn. Terroring Tuba. Toppling Trombone. Tenorous Trumpet. Blasting Base. No, base has got a string. All right, well, I lost it. So here I can Euro for three life and one card, or I can Hydroid for two life and two card. Let us do that. One, two, three, four. Auto pay. Draw some cards. Still not. Getting what we want off that, but let's plus one. What do we want here? What do we want? We probably want a Kiora at some point, so let's Kiora. Nothing. All right. They must have a, just a overrun in this deck. I can't remember how this deck kills you. Overrun? can just be their plan to play all their cards and lose those with life 23 cards left in the deck maybe they just accidentally deck themselves that could be fun we've got a long way to go before Thassa's Oracle does work but maybe it will ah there it is well and we die the way we live terribly so that is our five color titan deck if you are interested in doing nothing and enjoying it, give it a shot. Until then, that's the story of my defeat.